I was gonna say that I've forgotten how to do a reaction video, but like also I don't have like a cute plush or like song or anything, but uh, you could say that this is my reintroduction to being part of the reaction video world. Ah? Eh? No, that was bad. Welcome back to my channel. It's been a little while since my last video and especially since my last reaction video. Uh, I believe the last two I did were All Is Found from Frozen 2 by Hounded Fox, but specifically as far as uh, Peter Holland's reaction videos are concerned, uh, the last one I did was Shiny. So if you haven't seen either of those, I will leave links to those down below and you can check those out. But that is not why we're here today. No, no, my friends. The wait is over. I can finally make reaction videos again. Uh, Peter has been putting out new songs and new videos, and unfortunately, thanks to my resting face, uh, it's been kind of impossible for me to film reaction videos. But I am excited. Today we have Part of Your World from Disney's very own Little Mermaid. I have heard it before, as far as the audio is concerned. This will be my first time watching the video, so in appropriate reaction video fashion, let's get to the video. Uh, Remember to put headphones on this time because we established this a couple videos ago that I was doing myself a disservice by not putting these on. So we're doing that now. All right, and here we go. What? Oh my gosh. This song? Nah. Ashland is like a proper kid now. What? Look at this stuff. Oh, I recognize the scenery. Wouldn't you think my collection's complete? Wouldn't you think I'm the girl, the girl who has everything? I'm wondering if this is color graded or if they actually filmed all of this at like sunset. But like, ooh. we're gonna have to rewatch that. That rainbow flare was nice. Around here, you think, sure, she's got everything. Gadgets and gizmos are plenty. What the heck is that? What's <laughs> it's galore? You want thingamabobs? I got 20. That is the most genuine way of saying that I've ever heard, because if I tried that, it'd just sound condescending. I want more. Ooh, I want to be nice. where the people are. I want to see, want to see them dancing, walking around on those. Oh. For the idea. Oh my gosh! Yeah. I love making videos with you. Yeah. Um, if you guys like this, Disney, I have 
two albums. Well, it's one album, two disc set, 28 songs. Links for that down below. Anything else we should say? I think if you would like this one, you should like that one above. Yeah, you picked it out, right? Yeah. Ashlyn's favorite Disney video. Yeah. So, shh. Uh, patrons, thank you so much for making this happen. You guys are the absolute best. We appreciate them more than anything. Yes, and first, you forgot to do this. Peace and love. Yeah. Peace and love, guys. Yeah. Mwah. You're the best. I, I should do that every video. No. But peace and love. We're going to do that, that from now on. Every video. Okay. Thanks for the help. Peace and love. Mwah. Oh my goodness gracious. I mm, <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, where do Oh my goodness. Okay, first of all, Ashlyn's adorable. I'm just going to get that out of the way. I I can't. The the cuteness of this child. I just Oh my goodness. So wholesome. So precious. Okay. So like I was saying earlier, I recognized the set from the video, which I think he actually had in the description of the video, but uh, Peter also filmed We Know The Way, which I'm gonna put in the card up here. You should go watch that also, it's very good. And I did also film a reaction video, which I'll link to down below. But anyway, uh, location, on point, love it. Um, I did like the cuts back and forth between like the Hawaii-based scenes and the scenes on the couch. I thought that was really cute. I like how he incorporated Ashland as a, uh, you know, kind of like flounder in the original recording of that song. So that was really sweet. Um, again, at the parts where, you know, like Ariel's singing and then kind of like answering her own question and saying like, sure, or something, things like that. Uh, I think it was really good how Peter managed to kind of keep that like still sing songy and conversational um, <laughs> at previous karaoke parties that we've had anytime that there's something that sounds conversational or like a laugh in the song or something like that. Literally every time I've done it, I sound condescending. And I'm trying not to, but it's just my acting ability is not there. And then I just either sound condescending or sarcastic and it's bad. <laughs> so the fact that Peter could do it and keep it like, you know, still like cute and wholesome and basically sounding like a male Jody Benson is like, ridiculous but anyway all that to say he did really well i really liked the backing tracks uh, i did laugh when this scene came on just because i don't know why his shirt reminds me of guacamole i don't know why it just spoke avocado i don't know what that means that's i just got avocado vibes i i don't know why it makes no sense you guys should go pick up his album. It's not new anymore. <laughs> He's got a lot of really, really good tracks on here. Um, he split it into two different discs, one from like classic Disney and the one from like modern era Disney. So definitely worth getting if you're a Disney fan. I have listened to all of them. I don't think he's put out, no, he hasn't. He hasn't put out um, music videos to all of these yet, but most of these are out. So you should go check them out. I'll leave links to Peter down below. And yeah, it's good to be doing reaction videos again. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to like and subscribe. And I will hopefully be posting more often. I anticipate filming something else uh, later this month. We'll see if I can get my act together and actually film it. But I will see you guys soon. Drop me a comment down below and I'll see you guys later. Bye. curious but yes I did in fact get teased and somewhat bullied when I was younger because my name is Ariel prepubescent years it was very awkward because you know uh, Ariel from the Little Mermaid is one of the most scantily clad and it also didn't help that like I ended up getting a lifeguarding job and then my hair is not black anymore it like turned brown and like in certain lighting is like reddish brown and it was just like I definitely hated Ariel from the Little Mermaid for a very long time and now it's just Embrace the weirdness. Yes, I have the same name as a Disney princess. No, my parents did not name me that because of that. Yeah, I'll catch you guys.